Welcome today to Nathan Oxenfeld from Burlington, Vermont. Thank you, Gabrielle. Nathan. Really good to be here. Excited yeah. to talk oh. to you. Yeah, good morning, Nathan. Nathan, what are your main areas of work with color and light? Yeah, so it, for me, it all has to do with the eyes and vision. Um, I'm a natural vision improvement teacher. So I really like to explore how light and color can actually boost the performance of the eyes and the health of the eyes um, naturally. So maybe like as an alternative to using glasses and contacts and things, we can explore light and color as ways to actually heal our eyes naturally. Nathan, why is color important? Well, um, I feel like when in my own personal experience, when I first started working on improving my vision naturally, I started taking my glasses off and my contacts off. So I couldn't really see the details as well. But one of the first things that I really realized was that I could still see colors and actually see the colors better without my artificial lenses. And so that was sort of a early experience of mine of, of seeing the importance of colors. And then as my detail vision improved, the color vision improved too. So I think the color and the details are kind of linked when it comes to actually seeing more clearly gradually over time. Great, so maybe you already answered a little bit the next question. What is your main insight or a discovery that you have made working all these years with color and light? Yeah, definitely that one. But beyond that, I'd say that, you know, one of the main, I'd say the one primary way that I work with the light is with the sun, the sunlight. And so not, you know, that, that was a huge insight that I had was that I spent over a decade with myopia and astigmatism. So I had blurry vision far away. I expected to have to wear glasses for the rest of my life. And when I started doing the sun therapy and using the light therapy and color therapy, I was getting these clear flashes and actually focusing well in the distance without my glasses. And so it, it really opened my eyes to the, the potential that the sun can have if we use it correctly and safely. Um, and I'm excited to get other people experimenting with that too. Uh, Nathan, what are you going to contribute at our panel on December 14th, Color, Light and Health? I imagine I'm going to be definitely sharing some information about the sun therapy and, and safe, gentle ways to actually get that in as a part of our daily health regimen of actually, you know, working with the sun, but also alternatives to the sun. So maybe like covering some of the effects of, of red and infrared light that it can have on our cones and our retinas to actually kind of regenerate them as we age. Uh, Cause I tend to work with a lot of people who are, you know, 40, 50, 60, noticing trouble reading up close and things like that. So I'm really interested to share how light and color could sort of stave that off or kind of push that back until later in life. Wow, very much looking forward to that. So please join us on December 14th. It's at 8 a.m. Eastern Time and 2 p.m. Central European Time. And for signing up and details, please go to color slash See you then. Thank you.